Good afternoon. Well, I was able to watch the walkout and not only uh, students from the school showed up, but students from across Pierce County came out in order to stand in solidarity with 15 year old Landon Vance. Now the students say that they wanted to show Landon that he is not alone in dealing with this, but they also tell me that Landon is not the only student to deal with this kind of violence. Enough is enough. That was the message students at Graham Kapowson High wanted to send as they left their classrooms to stand in solidarity with Landon Vance. Vance was assaulted in one of the school's bathrooms on February 14th. Hey, chill out, chill out. Video of the incident was posted on an Instagram page that showcases fights that happen in the school. Initially, Vance was suspended for fighting, despite being on the autism spectrum. When Vance's parents shared their son's story, they say the response was so much more than they expected. It is just so beyond moving and humbling that every one of these people and youth have stepped out in support of enough is enough. I never expected this to turn into a movement. I never expected it to go viral. This is long overdue for these kids. While the school rescinded Vance's suspension, students say there's a history of violence that's gone on unchecked for too long. I barely graduated because of it. I could not focus on school. I could not focus on anything. I was more worried about keeping my friends safe and keeping myself safe rather than my studies. Are you surprised by any of this? I am not surprised. I wish it didn't happen, but I'm not surprised by it because it happened. Same situation happened two years ago. Special needs kid got beat up for no reason, and the school did absolutely nothing. Now students and parents are demanding that school officials do more to address bullying and violence. Just following the threads and what that we have on social media, every one of these kids is potentially a Landon and every one of them is tired of it. And hell or high water, we are gonna stop this for all the Landons, not just my Landon, but every one of them. Now, the Bethel School District sent me a statement saying that there is going to be a new curriculum that will be used at Graham Kapowson High that will teach students to be active and positive members of the community. And the district is not opposed to students expressing their views using peaceful demonstrations. The statement also reads that the, they wanted to make sure that parents understood that they take student safety very seriously, especially when it comes to bullying and fighting. And they are committed to making sure that Graham Kapowson High and all schools in the district are safe places to learn. But for now, we're live in Graham, Lionel Donovan, King 5 News.